Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Downside Player 713. Coming back with another video. <coughs> this video is gonna be a shoe pickup. Uh, it's kind of a boot, to be honest. I know, I know exactly what it is. It's coming from a, a little. Uh, it's not little, actually. I don't think it's little no more. I wouldn't call this a small black business. I say it's a pretty big black business. It's already expanded. Uh, it's been going strong for I think that I know of. It's going strong for at least three years, maybe two. Um, I'm not really sure how long it's been going. Uh, two that I know of, I think it's a year before that. But uh, I think you might have heard of them. They, he came out. His name is Devin, Dev, Devlin, Devlin something. I forgot his last name. Devlin Carter, or uh, I could be wrong on his last name, but I know his name's Devlin. He started his own little. Uh, well, stop saying little, right? He started his own company called Sia. S I A stands for somewhere in America um, it took a while to buy some of his shoes like I've seen them like when he came on the breakfast club he had some shoes already that were for sale but um, I didn't buy any of those it took a while to actually make a purchase and I bought a couple of them already and this one I wanted to unbox because I was really well just by the pictures it looks impressive I don't know what it's gonna be like in person but just from the pictures and the posts he's shown so it's a sick sick boot um i didn't want to miss out on it so far with his other shoes that i bought i'm pretty impressed what he does with the materials and um the shoe itself is pretty nice so let's show you what we got here Ugh, put it over here oh yeah that's pretty cool the box that's pretty cool i'll show you real quick there you go somewhere in america <clears throat> stands SIA that is a briefcase it's a briefcase these boots come in uh, one probably one of the selling points that I, I kind of decided to pull the trigger it was expensive I'm not gonna lie this boot was expensive but I think the box itself was pretty nice and the boot itself the boot and the box seem like it's worth the price we'll see right now now I don't think this is real Python I think this might be fake Python because I don't think he made i think he ordered these boxes from somewhere if i if i heard him correctly i think he was waiting on these boxes he had them made somewhere i don't know <clears throat> if it's real python but it looks nice even if it's fake it's real nice python looking detail so that's what the inside looks like as you can see this boot is called the tahoe the tie snake pot tahoe um comes with the dust bag same logo <clears throat> uh this is what the thing looks like this is the side. Let's pull up. Man, it's nice. It smells like a, if you ever been to like a Mexican store with uh, boots, Mexican boots, with alligator exotic skins, alligator crocodile, um, ostrich stingray. That's what it smells like. It smells like real genuine leather. Now, <clears throat> this is real python, from my understanding. This is real 100% uh, uh, python. There's no imitation on it. It's real Python, so actually, it's most pretty nice, pretty nice. And he's made a couple of Tahoes in the past. He's made different materials on them, different uh, stuff, different colors, different materials. This one I really, really loved because of the color. It's like a creamish slash pinkish kind of whitish kind of. I don't know. It's like a light pink, almost like a like barely pink, and. Just a little hints of cream. I would say this is cream. All of this part is cream. And this part is like a nice little pink. Slight blush, like a blush pink. It's really nice, man. It smells real good. It smells real nice. I don't know something about that smell. It's real, real nice leather. But yeah, man. I forgot what the price point on these was. I think it was like about... I want to say it was like 400 bucks. If I'm not mistaken, about 400 And uh, I don't mind. I don't mind spending that on this. I'm uh, actually... I think it's worth the money for real authentic Python. Very impressive. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna let y'all go. I'm gonna wrap this video something up to four minutes and a half. So just wanted to show y'all this real quick. I wanted to share it because I was really excited to see these in hand and show y'all what they look like. So till next time, thank you for watching.